Hey everybody, I have here with me today Nate Blinton and Eli Brooks. And uh, we're going to ask them some questions this morning. Uh, the first question is, what's your favorite verse? My favorite verse personally is Mark 9, 23, and it says, And Jesus said to them, Everything is possible for one who believes. And that really speaks to me because no matter where you're at in life, how low you can get or how high you can get, God is always going to be there. And if you believe in Him and what you're doing, He's going to have your back in everything that you do. And if you fail to believe, God is still going to love you just the same as He loves everybody else. And mine is Philippians 4.13. You can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. And Tim Tebow, he wore that on his eye black when he played college football. And that really spoke to me and millions of other people around the world. All right. Uh, the second one is uh, give one word that describes Christ. Mine would be a flashlight. And mine would be a compass. And it's we're kind of going to describe how it's like if you go out into the wilderness and you can't see or you don't know where you're going, God is still going to have you. So I'll let Eli explain why. He said flashlight. Well, without a flashlight, you can't see anything, and that's just like without God. So you're not, you're not going to know where to go. All right. And for me, when I say compass, I mean, as in the verse Psalms 32, 8, it says, The Lord says, I will guide you along the best pathway for your life. I will advise you and watch over you. And that just lets me know no matter where I'm at in life, God is always going to guide me in the right direction. If I make the wrong turn or whatever, He's going to redirect me into a better place no matter how far off the beaten path I get, he will find a way to redirect me. All right. All right. And the last question is, how do you see God through the activities you, you participate in? Like your hobbies, that kind of thing. I think me and Eli can both agree we find God uh, when we do our sports, no matter if it's football or baseball, we tend to see him. It's really like a brotherhood, and we all play for Christ together, win or lose. All right. And uh, for me, it's it's more of motivation, like, God gave us the God-given ability to be able to run around and do all the things that we can do, and we should, we should do it as a thank you to Him and worship Him for letting us do that. So I think we all we should play for Him and play for the other people nice. that, who don't have the ability. And no matter what happens, win or lose the game, it doesn't matter because we're winners in Christ. All right, well, thank you, guys.